I believe the morning sun Oh, he's gonna shine again And I believe a pot of gold Will to the river's end Oh, I believe the old is kissed with dough Why shouldn't I believe the same in you? I believe it may be That he doesn't make you charms And I believe in promises Spoken as you close your heart Oh, I believe in skies more than blue Why shouldn't I believe the same in you? You may say I'm a fool Feeling the way I do So yeah, you saw a bit of my singing. Uh, welcome back to Let's Play Ballad of the Bloodline. <laughs> In case any of you really want to hear the song again, it's Pollyanna, I Believe in You. It's uh, one of the songs in in the mother soundtrack and it's awesome so as you can see i've been grinding for rupees a little bit and that's because we need a certain item to whoa all right first thing first let's blow this up so i don't have to get scared by it again and bam one hit ko i think that's the first time i've ever done that to a manhandle a two <laughs> Alright. Whoa. Alright, I probably wouldn't want to step on that because I might get ambushed or something, but... Alright, if you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm going up to, like, a bomb shop or something. Mm. So, there's not really much to say. I just want to fill up a bit of time, you know? So yeah, help me remember I gotta keep this under 10 minutes. Because sometimes I can be really bad at remembering that. But I have a feeling I'll be filling up time anyway. So yeah, that's why I'm not cutting this. So yeah, we turn here and we what is with those pools of water or whatever that substance is I'm not really sure I want to know I'm so weird ouch alright so you just Cross through here, and welcome to the windmill shop. If you want to go out again, you need to buy some life-saving supplies. Then go around, go around. <laughs> it gets me every time. So yeah, let's buy this. And I don't really want to sh run short on rupees, but I'm going to buy the magic jar too. And I'll see, and you don't need to know the way back. I'll just see you guys in the overworld. All right, I'm back, and I'm close enough to my destination now, so I can show you where, guys, where it is. And I just want to pick this up here and point this out. You can shoot that with the level two arrows later and make a shortcut really handy. So yeah, we go down through here. kill a few snakes because you can never have too few rupees in this quest well you can never have too many rupees anyway and we're going to need every last rupee we can get coming up <coughs> yeah we go this way that's a Goma 2, I believe. You can't kill that thing with regular arrows, so don't try. 
All right, so we go in here, and this is probably the deadliest cave in the whole quest. What I suggest you do is don't even fight these guys. Just run as fast as you can like the gingerbread man. Nah. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Uh, okay, this is weird. Yeah, we got to super bomb this. And we go around, go around again. So yeah, we actually survived that cave. But where's the water gone? <laughs> That's like a reference to Pirates of the Caribbean, sort of. Sort of. Alright. So yeah, this is all that's left of Lake Hylia. Guessing. Right. Here we go. <coughs> Stand here and play the ocarina. I don't know what this song is. If I knew, I'd tell you. Alright, this is the part that got me stuck. For like, I don't know how long. You see this rock here? It blocks the way, but there do it doesn't look like there's any way to get rid of it. But Link always comes through. BAM! Hammer time! And that's how you get through there. Now we, get, now we got that out of the way. I believe there's something down here we can get. Yeah, this music is, like, epic. Alright, and down here there's a huge secret that... Well, you really gotta know beforehand or be really lucky. Down here. It's the Moon Pearl. It's a totally optional item. The level two, It's the level 2 amulet, and it serves absolutely no purpose other than to fill up your inventory. So yeah, that's one of those ultimate secrets Cast Chaos loves to put in his quests. Alright. Down there is what's left of the Lake Hylia Basin. So we're gonna go down there and see what's up. <laughs> Whoa, what's with the Zora? Ouch. Oh, you hook shot it. And we'll go in. Thank you for saving my daughter. We are part of the few Zora survivors. There are some more races too. We die here without food, but only the few of those return who goes out. We should get in a tasty fish. We'd be so happy for it. I'm so hungry, I could eat an rock. So yeah, let's give them the fish and see what's up. Disaster! Our hideout dried out with the whole lake. How could we fall for the trick of Vadi? What was the trick? Trick? Vadi took the form of our king after killing the real king and gave orders that later help him. Trick it was. The Zora king? Then it's really true. King Hyrule is Vadi too. I wonder what has befallen to Princess Zelda. This means that even the Goron king was fake? What a conspiracy. I don't know about the Goron king, but I see you are strong. Have this person free and go to the water source, which is now the source of a drought. Good luck. So that's where we're going to be going next. If we had a super bomb, that is. Which we don't. But I'm probably going to get that off screen. Yeah. Just run through these two manhandler twos. Or blow them up if you think you can. I don't think I can. And here is the source of the drought. So I'm going to go back and get a super bomb off screen. If you like this video, subscribe. Type in the upper right corner, big yellow button. Give me a five-star review down below this video. And be sure to check out my other stuff. Silly Cat 2, see you next time.